Hey everyone and welcome back to the Adults Play Java Minecraft server. It is episode 15 and we're starting off back at the starter village today. I say starter village, it's been <laughs> 14 episodes so far and uh, this starter bit is not yet done. But we're getting there, we're definitely getting there. And if you haven't seen already, I just released a video a couple of days ago on how to use armor stands to liven up your trees in Minecraft. So I think this is looking really cool. We've got some blossom on there. We've got some hanging apples. We've even got a couple apples on the floor here. But yeah, I'm absolutely loving this. And <laughs> for some reason, I seem to be getting a bit of a FPS lag off here. I might have to cool it on the armor stands a bit. But as I said, I do want to start getting this village completed and wrapping it up so we can move on to the main base area finally. But you can see I've actually laid out the groundwork for a new building over here. This is going to be the last large building for the village and this is actually going to be a school for all of the baby villagers. So yeah it's um, it's going to be made out of diorite again. It, uh, yeah we've got to stick with the theme of this village. It's diorite and white concrete and yeah I think school had to be made of diorite didn't it? <laughs> it had to be made of bird poop. Oh well. Uh, one other thing I do want to get done soon though is um, actually a little bit sad. I kind of want to kill off all these golems and the villagers as well. Uh, the main reason is I've been trying to get them to stop planting wheat and to plant carrots instead. But their inventories are filled up with wheat. Like every single one of them have inventories full of seeds and wheat. So no matter how much I remove the wheat here and toss it away and burn it or do whatever with it, sink it to the bottom of the ocean, they just keep finding seeds to plant. So what I want to do is get rid of all the villagers. Doesn't mean we're going to lose a couple of uh, guys with some decent trades, but that's nothing we can't get back. I mean, do we have any unemployed villagers? No, actually, because they're still going to have wheat, aren't they? Yeah, I'm going to have to go and find some villagers from a random Minecraft village or maybe from one of the other guys on the server and start to repopulate this place. It's, it's going to be kind of sad but it needs doing. So one other thing I've been doing between episodes is I've tidied up the coastline of this place. You can see the sand has gone. It's been replaced by dirt. We've also extended this coastline out as well. Let's just get up here so we can get a better view. But yeah, that coastline originally just kind of went around there. So we've brought it out to accommodate the school. Still needs a bit of tidying up. I haven't quite finished on it, but I have run out of dirt. So <laughs> the rest of that's going to have to wait a little bit longer. But I think for now, we just need to get back to building this school. And we're going to do that as a third person time lapse.
And welcome back. So as you can see, the exterior of the school is done and we've also got some of the interior done as well. So I think for the exterior, I'm gonna call it done. It's a couple of little bits of neat tidying up here and there, like that block missing, but for the most part, it is done. So let's head inside. Got our receptionist, making sure everyone signs in. Got our library slash reading zone. Our kids are doing a bit of brushing up on their reading skills. Uh, this one is busy writing something. Not very well, she hasn't actually written anything, but oh well, <laughs> that's what school's for, to teach them. Uh, we've got room 101 English, so we've got a couple of kids studying, and these ones are not doing that, they're passing notes about between each other. Now I do want to get a whiteboard or chalkboard at the front, um, I was thinking of basically getting a map of the void from the end, because that gives a kind of greyish colour. And just having that as the uh, the board, and then we'll have a teacher stood at the front. And then over here we've got the cafeteria. This little dude is waiting for some of the red stuff. Um, I'm not sure I trust it. I'm not sure what that is. Maybe some kind of meat with sauce. I don't know. Got some pies. This guy's trying a bit of pie there. Uh, this one's not able to quite reach the table, but uh, it's having a nice little apple. Upstairs, I haven't really done anything yet. I've put the desks in. These are the uh, science and maths rooms, but I haven't put any of the armor stands in yet because that is a lot of work. <laughs> it is a hell of a lot of work putting all these armor stands in. And unfortunately, don't have enough time to do it before the video goes out. So I'm gonna finish that off camera. Uh, you may notice though, this area is looking a lot uh, more empty than it used to because I have killed off all of the golems and villagers did die once to golem but they're all gone now we just need to find some way to repopulate this place with people who aren't going to plant wheat constantly <laughs> we need to get some carrots in here and potatoes and we'll get them farming those instead so i think it's about time we took care of some business on the server because as you can see we're still rocking our full enchanted diamond armor we don't have any wings and it's episode 15. <laughs> yeah, we fought the dragon ages ago and I still have not been and gotten an elytra. So that's what we're going to do. We're going to head off to the end. And I just realized I haven't crafted up any end crystals. <laughs> that would have been bad. But yeah, we're going to head off to the end. We're going to fight the dragon and finally get a pair of wings. Okay, so here we are in the end. I've reset my spawn point just outside. And... I guess it's time to give this a go. <laughs> a little bit nervous, it's been a long time since I fought the dragon on my own, but uh, yeah, let's see how this goes. <laughs> let's first get somewhere safe. Okay, so my plan of placing TNT on some of those did not work. <laughs> it's just destroyed the TNT. Oh well, <sighs> this is gonna be fun. I mean, so far, it looks like most of the cages are on the smaller ones, so that's good. Have we got a dragon? Oh, there she is. There she is. Alright, okay, let's start taking out some crystals, I guess. Oh, yes. Down in one. Let's try and get the ones without the cages first. Oh, she's coming for me. Try and get another one down. Trying to get me in right and you're making me move. Not got that one yet. 
cold and see <laughs> Didn't realize I was taking that much damage. Okay, we need to get a bit of purple. I still can't actually see that it's that high. Hey, oh. I can't tell if that one hit or not. But we do need to take care of these guys, so. That's um it doesn't have a cage. <laughs> Why are we pillowing up to one that doesn't have a cage? Oh dear. It's all going to hell. Alright, okay. I can't even see the thing. Come on. This is going to work. Nope. <laughs> that work. Oh, God. Oh, God. Why? Why? <laughs> Why did I think that was a good idea? Come on, hurry up. I need to finish you off so I can get back onto this drum. Was it just you? <laughs> Alright, let's figure out this ENT. Let's just do this normally. Where's the dragon? Oh, there she is. And she's coming for me. Space, maybe. Gosh, just right in the ears. Right, that should be enough. We should be able to get that. You know, if you want to like come down here and rest for a bit, I'll be fine with me. Let's go. Cool. Oh god, I can hear her. Oh, Jesus. Just, just come down and rest. Stop. God, you think I was trying to kill you or something? safe now. There we go. And is it just that big one left? Can we get it from here? 
Oh, there we go. Oh no, there's still that one there as well. There we go. Is there any left? Just see myself walking and ending the minute. Oh, there used to be a lot harder. Come on, just come down. Come down so I can smack you with my sword. It's the first time I've actually killed a dragon alone without a lightra. Should we just get more experience than that? Maybe that's just for the first kill, but um we did it. We have wings. Now I actually need to go and enchant them. Well, we're all enchanted up and I've got some rockets on me. We've actually got uh, plenty of rockets, but it's about time to do our first flight on the server. A uh, little bit more difficult than I thought. Looks like we've got uh, Roderen's mini game coming along over there. Let's not uh, spot too much of that. Wow. <laughs> As if it's been three months since the server started and I've just got an Elytra. Look how much stuff there is in this place. Everything looks so tiny from up here. But yeah, I'm so happy we've finally. Got some elytra. I believe this is the elytra launch pad. Great, Vegas Vic Bill. Launch and landing pad. Oh, I see. So the water so you can land without hurting yourself. That's very clever. I never thought of that. Oh, God, God. It feels so good to finally have elytra again. And here we are taking a uh, quick swoop over the starting village. I think it's only appropriate as we're now. I'm trying to draw close to my starter base, finally, after 15 episodes. 
be it. That is going to be it for today's episode. Uh, hopefully next one is the last one we spend on the starter village before we finally get uh, preparations underway for the main base. So if you've enjoyed the video, let me know down in the comment section below. And don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye. Can we do this under the bridge? Oh, yeah, we took a bit of damage. <laughs>